Hi everyone, I'm Shanti, the artist behind Shanti Fine Arts. Last month, I started a mixed media series based on watercolors and oil pastels, and the theme is zodiac sign. Last month's theme was Cancer. If you have not checked out that video, it is linked below in the video description. And this month, I present you the Leo. Let's check out how I created this painting. Just like in my Zodiac Cancer painting, in this Leo painting as well, I am doing a mixed media, which is watercolor and oil pastel. Obviously, watercolor has to go first and oil pastel will come later. But the amount or the extent in which I'm using each of these medium is obviously very different in this painting than the previous one. If you watch the pre if you have watched the cancer painting, you would notice that in that case I had used the watercolor only to create a minimal wash and, and like a background to the painting. And most of the painting was done with oil pastels all the details all the various layering mostly was done by oil pastels in this painting i had a lot of details to work with in the lion and the body of the leo woman and the flame and most of it i decided in this one to do with watercolor so i got a lot of details and a lot of the initial painting done with watercolors and later I just finished it off with oil pastels. The reason I used oil pastels is just to add the brightness and the real bold dashing colors to the entire painting and make it pop. So the oil pastels are used in this painting just to add the contrast and the hyper uh, value of contrast in this painting most of the other work um, and the details and everything is done in watercolors so that's a very basic difference between the last and this painting although they're both the same mixed media uh, using both watercolors and oil pastels on this particular painting i if, really wanted to paint a lion and uh, since I've never painted a lion with watercolors before so it was a very promising experience and using watercolor and oil pastel together I got to use the best of both the medium with watercolors I got to do a lot of details a lot of layering and uh, playing with a lot of uh, basic details um, in this beginning of the painting like general areas like na around the nose the mouth the teeth in the eyes all those details were very easy to do with watercolors um, in the lion face and uh, later when i came over with the oil pastel it really all all of it came together really well and uh, in case of oil pastels the real pop of color the contrast the real um, boldness that it added to the painting was the real benefit of using oil pastels over watercolor i used to not do a lot of mixed media but since this uh, series and since my exploration with mixed media i'm really liking this particular one now you can see that i have switched over to my oil pastels and uh, starting with the background you can see just the use of a single layer of oil pastels and uh, creating a gradient from the colors purple to blue to black is creating such a beautiful bright boldness uh, to the painting and since the or, already a lot of layering and a lot of color and a lot of details is already obtained with oil uh, watercolors in the basic layers all I have to do is just make everything bright and prominent and really catchy and oil pastel does that really well just a single layer can make it really bold with the colors and really eye-catching so around the eyes I used a lot of red to kind of give the fierceness to the face and then around the nose kind of hyped up the redness and in the lion's mane I used a lot of yellows and browns and used a lot of dark colors like blues and purples for the background and all of it came together and made this painting really really contrast full if for lack of a better word and in the 
place of the flame you'd see that layering and adding oil pastels just made it look so realistic just adding the flames in yellow and uh, the highlights with white made it look like almost a real flame so i i really I'm happy with the outcome of this painting and as we complete the whole series around the year and do all the zodiac signs I'm, I'm pretty sure that we will explore a lot more of this mixed media and uh, do it in various different ways and learn a lot of new things so keep watching every month for this series and obviously the other videos as well as you know I post of new videos every week in fact twice every week so if you're not already subscribed it is time that you hit the subscribe button and do not uh, all, all do not forget to push the notification bell so that you get a notification every time in the week i post a new video typically i post my new videos on wednesdays and fridays but i also sometimes have additional videos and live stream over the weekend depending on the my schedule it sometimes become a little hard to do two videos so three is a little out of scope but yeah you never know so that is my painting and uh, hope you liked it